Hello everyone. Okay, so let's provide a solution to this problem. Okay, so this is the equation before us. Now how do we deal with this? We can add what we have here. But before that, if you're new to my channel, subscribe so you can get more of my videos. And if you're not new and you have not subscribed, subscribe so you can get more of my videos. Okay? 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x will give us 5. Okay, let's say 2 to the power 2 multiplied by 5 to the power of x. Or 2 of 5 to the power of x. Right? Okay, so this is equal to 25. Let's make um, 5 to the power of x the subject. So we divide both sides by 2. Now 5 to the power of x is equal to 25 divided by 2. Now there's nothing we can do than to take the log of both sides. Okay, since I don't want us to have decimal, if not, if we divide this, we'll have 12.5. So we're going to take the log of 5 to the power of x. And then on the other side, we have log of 25 divided by 2. Okay. But then let's look at this. If you have log of a over b, this is the same thing as log a minus log b. Okay, so that's one of the laws of logarithm. So let's um, apply this to this. So we're going to have log 5 to the power of x equals, equals log 25 minus log of 2. So that the power here goes behind as we have x log 5 equals log 25 minus log 2 okay so if you if you are enjoying the, the 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 video and you have not subscribed okay so that means it's not um something is wrong so you have to subscribe okay so the next thing is to divide both sides by log 5 and you know why we are doing that so that x can be alone and whatever you do on one side you do on the other side so we're going to do this and then we divide this by log of 5 as well. This will take this away. So our x will now be log 25 divided by log 5 minus log 2 divided by log of 5. But mind you, I can apply change of base here, but I still want to simplify this. My one of my previous videos, I mean the last ones, I think um, we did something like this. This 25 can be expressed in the base of 5. So our x will be log 25 is 5 squared divided by log 5, which is this. Then minus, if we apply change of base here, we'll have log 2 to the base of 5. Okay, this 5 here becomes the base to the numerator. Now, there's a law, like I said before, that says the power should always go behind. So this means that x will be 2 log 5 divided by log 5 minus log 2 to the base of 5. Now, since we are multiplying, this is 2 times log 5. So since we are multiplying, this can go. And if that happens, x will now be 2 minus log 2 to the base of 5. Okay, so this is the value of x that we have. Okay, since we don't want to have anything in decimal form. Now, let us verify. Okay, so this is the... 
the value of x and the equation is 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x equals 25. Now what do I do? In place of this now, I'm going to write the whole of this. So we're having 5 to the power of 2 minus log 2 to base 5 then plus we're going to the other 5 so it will give us the same thing 5 to the power of 2 minus minus log um, 2 to the base of 5 so the question is will this give us 25 let's um, find out now from here we're going to apply one of the laws of logarithm again i mean law of indices a to the power of b um, divided by a to the power of c okay so the law says that you should pick one of the bases and subtract the powers because of this division okay so now this one right here is in this form and i'm going to write it in this form so i will pick five okay to the power of two and because of the subtraction in the power there will be division then i'll pick the same five which is this five then to the power of this log two to the base of five now if you have not understood this let me go through it now if you pick one of the bases right it will give you this five then we're going to subtract the powers using one of the laws of indices so it's going to be two minus this and that will give us the power there so we are adding we'll have this again which will give us this same thing that is five to the power of two divided by five to the power of log two to the base of five now 5 to the power of 2 is 25 now 5 here to the power of log 2 to base 5 okay these two are the same so they can just nullify each other and we have 2 there so we divide this by 2 then plus here again we have 25 and then we divide by that 2 over there okay so if this is the case Let's rearrange it. Remember, you cannot say 2 plus 2. I mean 2 plus 25. That would be wrong. So this can better be um, arranged as 25 over 2 plus 25 over 2. The LCM is 2. Then we add the numerators 25 plus 25. At the end of the day, we are having 50 over 2. And that is 25 so this is to confirm that our x is truly 2 minus log 2 to the base of 5 thank you for watching and I want to believe that you have already subscribed thank you for subscribing and thank you for watching to the end